Black Sea Odyssey takes the gentle serenity of fishing and turns it into a bloody fast-paced space adventure. Hello, this is Jamie from randomiseuser.com, and this episode of Alpha Soup is a quick look at Black Sea Odyssey, a game about hunting fish in space. Right, I'm playing a prototype version of Black Sea Odyssey called Vertical Slice 0.46, which is good because this is the time of day where I always like to have a cup of tea and a delicious vertical slice. Do do do. Okay, the first order of business is to get out of this intro area, and because nothing actually happens here, so it can just basically zoom out um, until the the map screen comes back up again. Ah, there we go. Eventually, after going a long way in one direction, you will leave the map, and you get up to the map screen. Um, this is the map um, that comes up between levels. Um, and each node here is a new area, each one containing unique stuff, different combinations of enemies, um, with everything themed to the local biome, such as crystal, nebula, parasitic, and jungle biomes, apparently. I'm just going to click on that. There we go. Um, the map itself doesn't actually do much at the moment, because there's only actually one level in this prototype. And this is um this is the sample level and it's in the crystal biome, so everything's very crystally. And um, that's my spear, which can go and kill Oh my god! The fish! The fish are attacking! Die! Die! As well as the spear, you've also got a harpoon. Hold round right, charge it up, and chuck it. Although there's nothing to chuck it out just yet. Oh god, there's loads of stuff to chuck things out. Ah! I don't think you can actually um get um, kill these asteroid thingies. Just avoid them, because they do hurt you if you touch them. Oh. Oh my god! There were was, there was several different kinds of enemies in this um, biome at the moment. Um, the little fish, and the, and the big fish, and the even bigger fish! Um, that's the narwhal type crystally spiky thing. It's horrible. It just charges at you. Oh! Oh god! Oh, the, as well as those little tiny swarmy bastard fish. Oh! Ah! Oh, oh, the teeth! Oh! Oh, you fish! Bastards! Oh god! Once you've attacked a certain part of the fish enough, you can use your harpoon and rip it off! Um, unfortunately there's so many bloody things attacking me at the moment, it's a bit hard to demonstrate. These are runes, um, basically power-ups. Um, you can collect these or buy them, um, it hasn't actually been implemented yet, um, and they can power up your ship and spear. And because this is a prototype, um, it just gives you them all from the start so you can experiment with them. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to make my spear a bit more powerful by giving it a split shot, um, fast attack, fire! And let's see, lethal. Let's, let's actually make it even faster. Um, and also, whilst I'm here, I'll give myself a little bit of extra speed for my ship. Right, that's more like it. Now, things are in my favour. Yes. Oh no, that's ow. Even the dead bodies can harm you in the crystal dome. Not the crystal dome. The crystal zone. Oh my god! Puffer fish! Uh, dead puffer fish. Yeah, it's a lot easier when you've got great big, um, <laughs> fiery things like this. Um, you can also, um, you can have different combinations as well. I mean, if, if I swap out the fire trail and the attack speed, we'll put in something else, like we'll have knockback and we'll have more splits. So now, my weapon is this! See, there's millions of arrows going all over the place. It's like a barrage of bloody things. Right, let's use our harpoon. Right. Um, get round the back, uh, charge, fire, rip! And I've ripped its bottom off! <laughs> How do you feel, mate? You got no bottom! <laughs> it's, but it's long since dead, admittedly. Uh, oh god, look at the recoil now! Um, that knockback put on my weapon. When they, when they die, they go flying! <laughs> I'll kick him into the next dimension! Right, kill him, kill him, kill him. Okay, rip its arms off. There! <laughs> you got no arms, you got no arms. Well, you've actually got three spare. You've got three spare! You greedy armed bastard! Um, but I'm weakening him. I'm weakening him. And he's got great defence. Those crystals at the back um, are great defence against you. Who wants to shoot him in the backside like that? And I can't. I have to go around the front. Um, but yeah, if you rip off his wings, he becomes less manoeuvrable and easier to kill. Right, the ultimate aim of the, um, well, of, at least the prototype anyway, is to get your lure up at the top, the statistic up at the top, lure, has to get up to 100%, and then you'll attract the boss. Uh, apparently, as you get further out on the map in the finished game, you will be able to fight um, bigger and badder bosses, until eventually you find the, the titan fish at the edge of the universe, um, which is the biggest fish of all, and I think that's, um, once you've done that, that's the game complete. But until then, there are many, many bosses to kill. Da -da -da, da -da 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 -da. Dun, 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 dun. Yes! Right. 
Ah, yeah. That noise means the boss is here. Oh, it's, it's somewhere around anyway. Look at that! It's going for a spin! <laughs> Uh, oh, 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 oh my god. Uh, penis enemy. Oh god, look at those spikes. It's like, like something out of Dan Simmons. Right, I need to get between the crystals. Right, it's now telling me harpoon, which means I've weakened him enough to be able to shoot him like that. And hopefully, if I can just get into the fleshy bit. Okay, charge up. Ow! Ow! If I can just hit the fleshy bit. Oh, I've missed again. Come on! Get in the... Ow! Bloody hell, everything's attacking me. Okay, okay, let's take care of some of these bastards. Oh no, I've just harpooned the bastard. Who cares about you? Go away. Die. Puffer bastard. Oh no! Okay, okay where's the boss gone? Oh, oh god, there... Oh, ow! There he is. <laughs> Found him. Okay, I'm going to harpoon him. There. Rip his bloody bum off. Gotcha! Yes! I um, could just leave that drifting in space! Now, um, no. okay, so um, bossy matey boy has now buggered off. Um, but he's going to attack me again quite soon. He's going to get his spikes on. To the crystal bomb! Okay, there we go. Harpoon. Rip! There! Another bit of his bottom gone. He's going to be bottomless by the end of the day. Right, I've got to get right inside him now. Oh, this is this is such an anal probe. Way get in middle. There we go. Oh no, no, it's not. I haven't hurt him enough yet. There we go. Okay. Oh wait. Oh god, that was close. Right. In, 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 in. No, nope. missed, 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 missed. Yes. And I've ripped his bloody. Oh my god, what's that? I've ripped something out. Oh, it's all sticky. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. One last hit. Come on, charge it. And rip his. Donkey bastard ball off. Yes. And that's it. Um, that's <laughs> a slightly sudden ending. Um, but yeah, that's Black Sea Odyssey. Um, it's early days, yeah, um, but it took me by surprise just how much fun it is. And it's a joy to control and fun to meet exotic new creatures. And then rip off their honkers. Yep, so the prototype can be downloaded from their site if you fancy giving it a spin. The final game is slated for Spring 2016 and will come out for Windows, Mac and Linux. Um, meanwhile, subscribe to Randomized User if you want more videos about interesting up-and-coming games like this. And I hope to see you again sometime. And bye now.